hi guys and girls welcome back to the channel i'm eddie and this is forex clubhouse where we discuss day trading tips and strategies to keep you profitable on a consistent basis today in this video we'll be discussing one of the most powerful and most effective trading chart patterns called the double top chart pattern and how it can be used accurately when you're trading in the markets if you want to be able to understand these patterns more practically so that you can be able to appropriately identify them on your own and trade them then this video is right for you so getting deeper into the charts, we are on volatility 50 index and this is one hour time frame. In the books, we are normally told that the double top is a bearish reversal pattern that occurs after an uptrend. Now this is true, but what if I tell you that this same pattern can be also used as a continuation pattern? Now stay with me. Let's first see how this current downtrend movement was going. But before I give you that bonus tip, please take this time to like this video, hit the subscribe button and turn the notification bell icon on as it will mean a lot to me. Now here's the bonus tip. The market, and here I mean any market, moves in three phases. Impulse, then comes correction, then after the market is done with moving sideways, it breaks the structure and forms another impulse making our three phases to complete. Then the cycle continues as follows. Now let me mark my levels right here and then put an arrow indicating that the market direction is on the downside so that I can get a green chart and be done with this mess one right after marking these zones. Now, looking right here, we were usually looking forward to sell right here on a retest and continue with the trend. But as you can see, the market was retesting here for the second time. No weak rejections formed. On all of my videos, I always say you must look for weak rejections because those weeks is a sign of exhaustion from other sides of the traders, either buyers or sellers. So as you could have expected, the market did provide a fake out on this zone right here because no weak rejections were formed whatsoever but that doesn't mean that our downtrend is now over because we know for a downtrend market to be over the previous lower high has to be broken which as you can see here it didn't now here's when you need to be extra careful in observing how the market will be reacting because at the end trading is just a game of probability. Now let's take a closer look at how the double top pattern works. The first peak represents a high point where the buyers are actively buying and pushing the price up. However, at some point the buyers run out of steam and the price falls back down. The price then goes up again and the buyers try to push it to a new high, but they are unable to do so. The second peak is usually slightly lower or equal than the first peak, which is an indication that the buyers are losing their momentum. After the second peak, the price falls back down and this is where traders can short the position. Now, the idea is to sell at the resistance level, which is at the top of the second peak, only after the formation of candlestick weak rejection throw like the one you are seeing right here. It's important to know that the double toe pattern isn't always easy to spot, and traders need to wait patiently for confirmation before entering any trade on trading this pattern. Confirmation can come in form of break below the neckline which is the line that connects the two lows between the two peaks or at the second peak resistance level only after the formation of weak rejections. In conclusion guys and girls, double toe pattern is a bearish reversal pattern that can be used by forex traders to identify potential short opportunities after an uptrend or as a continuation on a downtrend. By patiently waiting for confirmation and using proper risk management techniques, traders can take advantage of this pattern and make profits in the forex markets. Thanks for watching. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below and I promise to reply every, each and every comment in the comment section below. Please don't forget to like and subscribe for more trading tips and strategies. Until next time, happy trading.